Are you keeping me? Today we have an unboxing from the cubicle.us. So it's been a while, so uh, why don't we get right into this? Here we have the Yushin Red 6x6. My first impressions on this cube was that I noticed the pieces looked very small. If you compare it to a Shengshao as you see here, the pieces have a tremendous difference to them. The turning on the Yushin Red is slightly similar to the Bo Chuang GT, I love the feeling. I was actually hoping it would feel like that. The Yushin does not pop whatsoever, but I do have tight tensions on it currently. On my third solve I ended up getting a PB, and now I'm a full minute faster than I was before on the Shengshao. Yushin Red 6x6 is a fantastic cube, and I highly recommend you buy it. It's only $29 on the cubicle.us. Next up we have the X-Men Galaxy and Megamix. I noticed right off the bat that it's much bigger than the Shengshao. The corner pieces look nearly as big as a 3x3's corner piece. I was very surprised about that, and I think this is a fantastic advantage. I got the sculpted version, which is currently only available in Sticulus. I've done about 20 solves on it. The first 5 solves or so, I had trouble distinguishing the cream and the white shades but it becomes easier as you get used to it. I don't do Mega Minx too often, so I haven't really had any improvements yet. The Chi Square One is a major, major upgrade from what I've had. I have an MF8 version 1 all the way back from 2012 when I bought it from Cube Depot. The turning on the Chi is amazing. It feels like a 3x3. Out of the box, I had some issues with a few lockups, but that was due to excess plastic inside of the puzzle, which went away as you solved more. I'm 100% satisfied with it, and even if you're not into Square One, I highly recommend you get this puzzle, because it really made me want to get into it more. And maybe learn the parody alg finally. Lastly, here we have the YJ Yusu R. This honestly isn't my favorite cube out of the box. I feel like it's very blocky, locky, and just, it doesn't really give me any better times. That could still be due to my tensions, but actually it puts me 20 seconds slower than normal. I'm still currently using my Aosu with Weisu soft springs, maybe once I get the whole cube apart and tension it, I'm gonna be better. I also got some Yushin 5x5 springs for my 6x6, and I got my custom sticker shades. I'll be attending a competition in Charlotte, North Carolina this weekend for Discovery Place 2016. It's a whole museum dedicated to Rubik's Cubes and beyond. I don't know many cubers in the area, but if you're watching this video and you're also going, let me know. Also don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video.